Hello, it's Sid Survival Glory Avictis, and I want to show you how to create your very own mode. To begin, choose Scenario Editor. Uh, if you have modes, it displays here. Uh, if not, uh, or maybe you want to create your new mode, choose cre Create Scenario. Uh, first, choose Scenario Name. It will be displayed in Steam Workshop, in uh, custom game, so in game uh, to, to start the scenario, so it's quite important. However, uh, it can be changed later, so you don't have to make your final mind uh, right here. Uh, scenario author, uh, just write your name uh, as you choose. Uh, next, in played scenario. Uh, for this moment, uh, we've got just one scenario to choose, Edring's Last Stand, but uh, in the future, with next DLCs, there will appear new maps, uh, so it will be extended. Next one is uh, Load from Team Blade, and here is uh, let's say, the biggest choice for this moment. First one from the top, empty, uh, just Enviro. It contains the only basic things required to start the game. So just one character, just one scavenge point, uh, and, uh, and uh, Bastion box. Yeah, the place where you put uh, your items to send it to best. And next one is basic economy. And so it contains uh, workshops and its mm, receipts. Yeah, crafting requirements, uh, all receipts, uh, how to create items in those workshops build it by the player. Next one, full economy. It's uh, It contains basic economy, but uh, got added uh, the piles, yeah? The rubbles uh, on which are scavenged during the night, yeah? Placed by us. Uh, next one, basic story. So, also, it contain, contain full economy, but with uh, text events. Uh, however, those text events are available to use to place on the map to set up triggers. Triggers are kind of rules uh, when something should appear on the map or, or disappear, be active, how to start it, uh, what, are, what are requirements to, to use that. Uh, and the last one is full content, so we, you've got totally everything how it is in game. So with piles, with text events placed on the map, with triggers, all set up, created by us. Uh, and the main question is which option to choose. If you are, are starting your story with uh, modes, uh, or it is first mode in Seed Survival, uh, I would recommend to use full content, because you can always hide something or, or delete our uh, setups, uh, but you can take a look, uh, see how we created, uh, with what solution we have chose, uh, so you can just adapt that to your ideas, uh, see how to how to realize some things. If uh, if you want, uh, if you have created few mods in in our game, or just just go up, yeah. Uh, it it all depends on you what you want to create, yeah. Um, if you want. Uh, keep, let's uh, call it, keep our game and uh, just make a different story, uh, make it look 
a bit different uh, keep the economy uh, because it, it's uh, I think one of the hardest things yeah you you don't have to count everything again uh, create uh, workshops from the beginning uh, just just make uh, some room for for the story and go on if you want to create very own game uh, we, we have been talking about this uh, in, in the office and uh, the, uh, our tool allows to create even different types of game uh, so if you want use the empty and you will have a lot of space to, to create very own thing of course it, it will be costful however it can be worth it and the last thing Scenario version. For this moment, uh, sadly, I have just one option: onboarding with tutorials. So the very basic uh, scenario, we, which is seen by every player uh, for the beginning, yeah, the, the first try to to play the game. Uh, however, uh, very very soon. We will add the other three options, which can be seen here. Uh, scavenger, Defender, Survivalist. Yeah? Uh, to show you uh, what option you will have, uh, it will be the easiest way to choose the new game plus. Here you can see Scavenge Point. And this scaven under this scavenge point uh, will be hidden um, our layouts uh, of level design of, of the city created by us. So the onboarding, as I said, is very first scenario. So you start right here, go to the marketplace, and you have a choice to go here or, or here to the golden corner. Um, the next one. Uh, is let's say scavenger if I remember well scavenger starts here uh, in crafts uh, so uh, you can go to the marketplace here to the part uh, some different options uh, defender starts here uh, in golden corner uh, and survivalist starts also here the same point as uh, onboarding however you go to the high city in the beginning and got choice to go uh, here to the marketplace this way or to the golden corner yeah because this and this way is blocked for the beginning uh, yeah this layouts differ uh, because we we got closed or open some ways which which can be and be uh, changed in the editor yeah so you have to choose one from the four uh, layouts which you will be working with yeah um, there is many many ideas many many small things uh, differing between those layouts like uh, stairs allowing to go up to these walls um, some parts destroyed here uh, some ways blocked forever like here uh, like uh, destroyed building allowing to go this way or the whole building where you can't go through here so mm, I, I advise to, to play those four uh, scenarios. Uh, I guess you know the basics. So these three scenarios, these three challenges, uh, for just for a while, like five, seven days, you will know at least a bit how how it feels, how it leads the player. Also, the the very important things. Uh, these layouts are, are hidden under uh, these passages. Uh, however, uh, it don't have to be the uh, first 
uh, scavenge point, yeah? So you can choose this option, uh, defender, if I remember well. Uh, but you can uh, later in the editor choose to start just here, yeah? So you will have the layout uh, of the city from this scenario, but you will start here. Okay, you are the creator of the creator of the mode. You can start here. Of course, it doesn't have to be here. You can place uh, scavenge points wherever you want. But uh, I will tell you about that later with next options. Okay, so let's see the scenario. 